It is a decision which places the leaders of this city in an open and bad-tempered standoff with Westminster. Whether to put Greater Manchester in the highest tier of local restrictions and what support to offer in return. The mayor saying he will fight back and stand firm against government plans. We have unanimously opposed the government's plans for Tier 3. They are flawed and unfair. They are asking us to gamble our residents' jobs, homes and businesses and a large chunk of our economy on a strategy that their own experts tell them might not work. It has led to some bemusement among those in this city caught in the middle of this dispute. We must act now. Delayed action means more deaths from COVID. The staff at this gin bar were expecting the health secretary to announce measures that would almost certainly force it to close. Measures the owners told me are unfair. This is not going to instantly bring numbers down. And how long will we be in T T3 for? Like, we don't know whether it's going to be three weeks, four weeks. It Plausibly, it could be till next year till we're in uh, uh, Tier 3. And that is just... It's going to cripple Manchester's economy. Much of the argument is about how much support workers like Laura will get if the bar has to shut. Hello, Laurita. <laughs> You're right. Both she and her partner Carolina work here. Under the government's plans, they'd get two-thirds of their wages, less than the original furlough scheme. We're both in the same boat. There's no safety blanket type of thing. I want to get on the property ladder. I want to buy a house. So... I want to I want to be comfortable in my job knowing that like my job's going to be okay. Local leaders accuse ministers of being prepared to sacrifice jobs here to save others elsewhere, but the health secretary says swift action is needed in those parts of the country where the virus is spreading the fastest. What I'd say to local leaders is set aside this party politics. We want to work with you. We want to work together to make sure that we get a set of measures that can get the virus under control, that can start to bring it down, and where we can support people through that. We've put in place an unprecedented package of support. It's unclear what will happen if they can't reach agreement. What's beyond dispute is that the virus won't wait for this row to be resolved. Ben Chapman, ITV News, Manchester.